Hello, everyone. This is from Milwaukee to Nashville. I am Daniel Goodemo. No, there it is John Landowski. How are you doing, John? Hey, pretty good. Um, as we rev up, I wanted to give a quick notice to our sponsor, Hockey Locker. Thank you for um all your support. Um, 2002 West Hart Avenue, Milwaukee, Wisconsin. You can call them at 414-800-7585 or visit their website at hockeylockermilwaukee.com. Um, I forgot to update this in my Admirals video, but uh, the Black Friday games, uh, other known as the day after Thanksgiving, um, John has a family function he is attending, and I am going to be in some sort of food-induced coma. <laughs> mm -hmm. um, and spending time with my family as well that day. Um, we will be back on Saturday, the 26th. So just a fair warning on that. So after the 23rd, you guys won't see us till the 26th. Um, we will put up graphics for Friday's game. And if something major happens, we may jump in. But it all depends on what goes on, really. Right. Um, also feels how much I'm up to doing. So it's kind of like a thing right now. We'll see where we're at as I know for a fact that um, the Preds game is going to be a lot harder than anything else. So, um, Also, uh, December 1st, we're also not going to be able to do that day as well as I have prior engagements. Um, so uh, just a fair warning as well there. Um, just kind of keep you guys up to date. I do have things that I have to do. Um, on behalf of from Milwaukee to Nashville, whether they're, you know, they're not. Um, but today the Preds took on the uh, Tampa Bay Lightning as it was their Hockey Fights Cancer Night. Um, I fight for my cousin Mikey, my grandmother, um, and for here. Um, also my friend Robert, so um, he had uh, skin cancer. So um, I, those are the people I fight for. Um and John, anytime you want to chirp in, be my guy. Yeah, I fight for anyone who's currently battling or is battled and is in remission. Yeah, uh, that's where I met. Um, my cousin um, had, um, I think it was a uh, testicular cancer at 23 years old. No man should have to go through that that young. So, um, uh, just something that we all. Uh, everyone has a family member, a friend, someone they know, someone they know that they know, you know, someone knows someone. Um, but today, the uh, like I said, the Preds took on the Lightning, um, and that game started about an hour later than the Admiral game. So if you're wondering why yeah. we're late tonight, we were waiting for the completion of the Preds and Lightning. So at this point, all right, so um, shots on gold, lightning outshot the Predators 39 to 32. Faceoff percentage was dead even at 50%. On the power play, the lightning went two for five. The Predators went one for five. In penalty minutes, both teams had 12 minutes. The Predators out hit the lightning 35 to 20. The Predators outblocked the Lightning 22 to 10, and in giveaways, the Predators had 13, the Lightning at 12. Also, I would like to add the Lightning outshot the Preds in the first period 18 to 12. In the second period, they outshot them 12 to 8. In the third period, Nashville outshot them 11 to 6. And overtime, Tampa Bay outshot them 3 to 1. Doesn't help when they were just gift wrapped in a power play, but that's neither here nor there. Um, Scoring in the first was Phil Forsberg with his seventh of the season with an assist from Matias Eiffel, his fifth, and Yuso Parson in his second. That was scored at the on the power play at the 150 mark. Then the second period at the 425 mark on, on the power play, the lightning got on the board from Nikita Kucherov, his tenth of the season. Assisted by Point, his 11th, and Sergachev, his 14th. Then, period at the 504 mark, 
The Predators get on the board again from Nino Niederreiter, his ninth of the season, assisted by Duchesne, his tenth. Sorry, folks. I've gone all night without smoking. I am so sorry. I am going through withdrawal. Um, then they're scoring to tie the game up, literally right as I turn on the game when I walk in the door. Alex Kalorn scored his sixth with an assist from Cole, his fifth, and Kucherov, his 17th. Uh, then uh, Steven Stamco scores in overtime on the power play with his 10th of the season with an assist from Kucherov, his 18th, and point his 12th. That was on the power play. Um, Your three stars of the game are... Uh, third star of the game was Phil Forsberg. Second star of the game was Andre Vasilevsky. Second, first star of the game was Steven Stamkos with the game-winning goal. Um, Andre Vasilevsky stopped 30 of 32 with a 93.8 save percentage. Um, UC Staro stopped uh, 36 of 39 with a 92.3 save percentage. Um your scratches were Zach Sanford, Yakov Trenet, and Mark Jankowski. Uh, for Nashville, Phil, Phil Myers, Cole Kepke, and Nick Hermix. Uh, for Tampa Bay, head coach for Tampa Bay is John Cooper. Head coach for Nashville is John Hines. Um, referees were uh, Chris uh, Schlecker um, and Frederick LaCour. Uh, lines of it were Brandon Gorlitz and Jonathan DeChamp. Um, and, you know, and here's where I sit. Uh, Glass played. He had four shots on goal, two hits, one giveaway, one takeaway, 50% on the face. Uh, Yusuf Parson did one assist, no shots on goal. Six hits, one giveaway, and was 67% on the faceoff while playing 17 minutes. Um, so that that speaks volumes. Uh so like I said, we're back on Monday. We got a few days, but like I said, on uh the 25th, we are not going to be doing shows um as it sits we will kind of um keep it up today if we know something but um we'll we'll work it out so how huh? um as i say we're very i'm very tired the john's tired we're both mm. yawning <laughs> It's been a long day for both of us. I've been up since 6 a.m. It is now 11 o'clock. No nap. So I am going to say so long, farewell, Avita, say goodbye. Have a wonderful night.